Yo, what is up everybody and welcome back to another NBA 2K17 My Career Game where Amari Carroll was going upstairs early to get the slam. We crossed the border and we are in Canada going against one of the best teams in the league, the Toronto Raptors as Corey Joseph gets the and one finish right there. The Young Kings throwing in the oop and it's thrown down by Believe Papa Giannis. I think I got his name right right there as you see the replay. That's going to be our first assist of the game. Still getting used to our new teammates finding Matt Barnes on the cut and he finishes pretty nicely inside still trying to get minutes enough to be a starter I think we're getting close as you see Jared Solinger off the dribble and one finish right there of course as you guys know Solinger in real life is injured so he's not playing right now as we're gonna get a perfect release on the jumper but in 2k he is the starting power forward for the Raptors and he's doing pretty good as we blow by the Rosen throw the lob but the layup is missed I believe it was Papianis again and we get a nice little Sort of screen, but we missed the shot right there. Papa Giannis doing <laughs> the dirty work right now as we get a uh, Boogie Cousins feed right there. Always love playing in the game with the Marcus Cousins. As we step back, no one guards us. Gotta pull that. We're a sharpshooter. They're gonna give us that kind of space. We gotta pull it as we get some space. Pull it again and miss the three pointer right there. I don't know what it was. I'm just better shooter in the US, but it's kind of cold this game. Kind of missing all the threes early on as you see Willie Coley Stein with the rebound. We're running a pretty big lineup right here in the corner got it that is matt barnes barnes can shoot that jumper not well but pretty decent he's got some decent three-point shooting stats he also attacks the rim right there and we are benefiting a lot from matt barnes uh, to get assist you wouldn't think that as we get a block on kyle lowry keeping the game close in the third quarter of course when you come off the bench and you don't play late in games you know all your job is mainly just to make sure the deficit doesn't blow up just maintain everything while you're in here don't do anything crazy we're doing a good job that we have 11 six and the screen assist right there helping out Rudy Gay as we get towards the end of the third quarter getting a steal on Terrence Ross ball in our hands pulling up perfect release from downtown finally knocking down a three we were 0 for 4 before that shot we're looking to create some more Corey Joseph gives us space and another perfect release a career high 16 so far and we are eventually just going to try to pass this ball out didn't have much to do right there but they double team us since we're scoring very efficiently or I, I could say officially we have a couple missed shots but um we're taking good shots right now so they double team must respect us and that's gonna get Rudy Gay open here's Gay again and one finish of course Rudy Gay used to play for this team and right now he is showing off against them the lead up to 17 and it's up some more Esther Costa Kufos gets the finish right there and as a bench unit we kind of won the game for them. And thankfully, they didn't blow it once we sat down, but we definitely helped them out. And a big reason why is Denny Tice in the corner, finding the open man and getting his first career double double to close things out on the road great game even four rebounds that might be a career high for us we don't really rebound too well we move on to the next game now we're at home against the new orleans pelicans i have to make sure i didn't say hornets i still say new orleans hornets a lot when i started playing uh started watching basketball they were the hornets and then they changed their name to well, i mean they gave the charlotte hornets back their name more than anything else as we knocked down a Pretty big time three right there over Tyreek Evans from shooting pretty badly the last game. We are doing better now, but we get blocked inside by Oshik. Quincy Pondexter with the ball. You guys see the Pelicans. Speaking of injuries with that Raptors team, you see Buddy Hill go all the way. The Pelicans team is very banged up than what you see on the court right now. Drew Hall, well, Drew Holiday is not hurt, but he's gone. He should be back soon. Tyreek Evans is hurt. Quincy Pondexter is hurt. Costa Kufos gets the and one finish inside right there. But look at how our teammate grade. We're at a D right now. We are struggling. Even though we knocked down that shot, that's not helping out our teammate great any bit. We have three turnovers early on, making some bad plays. We're going to find Kufos, who fumbles the ball, but still finishes at the end of the second quarter. Trying to find a big man with good positioning. In the third quarter of this game, that's when we kind of change things around as Kufos gets the block inside. We're on the court at the same time with the Marcus Cousins. We don't need Boogie right now because we are knocking down the corner three to keep this game close. But, um... Anytime I try to play, I play on the court with DeMarcus Cousins. I try to get him the ball as much as possible because he's, he's easily the best playmaker on this team. Even against Anthony Davis, I don't mind giving him the ball 
getting out the way and letting him work as he gets the and one finish over to Brow. Once again, looking for Boogie, but he's being fronted, so we give him the great feed, and he throws it down. That's just all about, you know, knowledge of passing lanes and stuff like that. As you see Pondexter take kind of an ill-advised three. That's not going to fall down. We get the ball. We're looking up ahead. You see Costa Kufos has a step. Get it inside, and he's able to draw it up foul right there. And we're just making good plays right now, trying to earn our spot in the rotation. Hopefully, get a starting spot. As that was not a good play. I tried to force it to Demarcus a little bit too much, but we draw the charging foul on Tyreek Evans on the other end. But yeah, the starting guards for this team is Garrett Temple and Darren Collison. So it shouldn't be too hard for us to find our spot in the rotation as Boogie spots up in the corner. Demarcus Cousins has that three as we get some four quarter minutes right here early on, finding Rudy Gay inside. He's going to get the finish, working on our second consecutive double double after having zero before the last game we played as Drew Holiday with the tough finish right there. Thought we played good defense, but um. Sometimes when they get that deep, it's all about what they do, not exactly what you do if you don't block this shot as that ball goes out of bounds. And we are actually going to get subbed out the game, but not for the entire game because we get subbed back in with a minute 17 left in a one-point game that's blocked by the Marcus Cousins under a minute to go, trying to give our team the lead. It's Boogie Bang! The Marcus Cousins in the other corner this time is wetting them up. He's at the power forward posi position. He can easily play center. I don't know why he's at the power forward spot, but it's working out for us as Drew Holiday misses the shot to tie the game back up. We give it to DeMarcus. He's our guy. He finds Gay and one over Evans. Rudy Gay makes the free throw. Five point game. These guys need a bucket quickly going inside. Ashik draws the foul on DeMarcus. He missed the first one and he misses the second free throw. They call a foul on Cousins before he can get the ball out. He ends up making both free throws, and that all but solidifies the victory for us. So we come in in the clutch and help our team win the game. That's all you can ask for, man. That's all you gotta do. Just keep on grinding, and hopefully we get our start starting spot soon. And um, yeah. So we watching the video if you guys enjoyed it. I got blocked at the end there. I was trying to get the double double, but yeah. We watch you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe for more. I'll catch you guys next time. Got a quick cutscene before the video Chris, ends. what city are you in right now? You gotta get a winter coat for these away games. I cannot believe I forgot to tell you that. Or do they give you guys coats? I don't know. They should. If you get sick, then y'all won't be any good, right? They should just give you coats. Uh, talk to you later, baby. Bye.